It's BAFTA week and talk is getting louder as to who is going to land the big prizes. The London Evening Standard British Film Awards gave us a hint as to who may do well and it's good news for Andrea Riseborough. The star of Shadow Dancer, nominated for a Rising Star Award at the BAFTAs, won Best Actress and she was clearly pleased people had bought into her character and the film. You work on something for such a long time and you're so passionate about it and then you're so excited other people are responding to it in, in that they, they, it's valuable to them in some way. One of the most wonderful things about the job is really that, that I then was able to research it and uh, just a fascinating period and it's, you know, it's, very, it's still very much with us. There was a shock in the Best Actor category as Daniel Day-Lewis was pipped to the gong by Toby Jones for his role in Barbarian Sound Studio. Uh, Daniel Day-Lewis is a hero of mine, so to be even mentioned in the same breath as him uh, is a huge honour. I grew up watching his movies. The idea that I'm being in some way compared with him is both on one level you know, extraordinary to me, but also I, I've got to be proud of that. You know. And Sightseers backed up its critical acclaim by scooping the Peter Sellers Award for comedy. Its writers and co-stars were delighted with the film's success. It's been a labour of love for us. You know, we started this. You know, we were just it just came from a, a sketch idea ages ago, and we were just working as com comedians. And yeah, that's what it means many a years lot. Late, you yeah. know, it means a huge amount to us. It's our baby, basically. But um, but also because there was such an unusual process of actually making the film for it to get a critical response. I think it's um, it's great for us because we feel like we'll we'll have more chance to use that method to make more films than maybe other comedy writer performers will get to make more films. So it's a lovely thing for us. But we'll have to wait and see which faces are smiling after the BAFTAs on Sunday 10th of February.